This has been the hardest, the hardest week in my 48 years in this planet. It's been the hardest week to exist in my skin and in my blackness. It has been that way for all of us that have this skin to wonder what it is and as to whether or not we get to be Americans just like everyone else. But for all of the surfers that happen to be black, we've known and experienced challenges in this community that would probably shock you because it's been very hard for people to perceive perhaps that people that don't look like them can love the ocean as much as they do. Racism is not a thing that we will stand for in the United States of America. We're going to take the full eight minutes and 46 seconds that George Floyd experienced in that brutal lynching that we watched on television. We're going to take that full eight minutes and 46 seconds of silence and then we're going to paddle out and honor his life. Officer, I can't breathe. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Mama. Mama. Mama, I can't breathe. And there's something about this pandemic that we've been existing in that has acted like a black light and exposed any of our systems that simply just don't work. But I do believe in the America that we can be. And as I look out right now at this crowd, this is the America that we can be. I hope that you guys will be here tomorrow and the next day and the next day and continue to stand for this thing that we call unity and tell racism that it can go and kick rocks because that's not what surfing is about. What do we want? What do we want?